is going on everybody it is professor z back here with another video today i hope you are excited because i know i am i'm covering one of my favorite projects um it is ancient dragon alliance now i have done a video on them in the past um and it's just it's been a while so i wanted to do a quick update video on them uh they have a lot going on uh they've got they implemented a couple of new things which i think is a lot of fun so we're going to cover all that today so i hope you guys are ready so sit back relax and let's get going now as i said we are covering uh one of my favorite projects ancient dragon alliance we're going to start off in the discord because one of the things they have going on now which is the weapon uh mint it involves the discord it's a really cool aspect that they've added it is kind of it's a combat system so you can go in you can go in and mint the weapons so if you look here, you got the weapon mint info here. Uh, they are minting through Brave Dogs. So you would click here, it's 100 ADA per weapon, um, but you have a chance at different ones. Each weapon itself comes with 3000 Horde and then it earns 100 Horde, I believe, um, for the first three months, which we'll talk about Horde and all that here in a little bit. Um, but yeah, it's, it's pretty awesome, pretty epic. And then once you mint a weapon and you go in and connect your wallet to the farmer bot, you can go down here to the different coliseums and have battles. So as you can see here, I had a battle with Kyrie yesterday. Um, unfortunately, I lost, but the battle system itself is really, really cool. You can bet Horde if you want. Uh, if you can just play for free, the winner automatically gets 50 Horde. And so it starts off by someone challenging. So you're like, well, how do I challenge somebody? simple you go right here hit the pinned message and it talks about it right here so you enter the command start battle uh, and, and, and the command itself will walk you through like who you're challenging and stuff like that um, and then it'll prompt that person to accept or decline uh, the fight so once they accept you each pick your weapons ah he beat me with Lucille I didn't even look because I accepted it as I was watching my kids yesterday so I was kind of busy but I accepted it and then I had to walk away but I saw he beat me but I mean, it's really cool because it goes through all these things. Um, it, it talks about like how much damage is done to each person. The weapons all have different uh, stats to them, which is really cool. But it just kind of goes through here. And as you can see, you know, he, he did beat me. He did defeat me. So he got his 50 horde for being the victor. Um, but there's four different coliseums set up so people can go in and battle. Uh, they did just run for the clan wars, which I know I've talked about before in a different video. Um, I'll talk, I'll, I'll touch on that a little bit in this video too, but right now I wanna talk about the weapons. So they did just run like a, an event for the clan wars where it was a, a fighting and a, a Coliseum event. It was really cool. Um, like this, this is one of the projects that you, you love to be in. Um, it flies under the radar, but Osiris, who's uh, one of the founders is like, I mean, he's one of the best dudes in the space. He knows what he's doing. So it, it's one of those things that's fun to be in. But yeah, that, that's the weapons there. Um, I, I will show you a couple. So these are, these are my weapons. Um, I have some really awesome ones. I've got 50 total so far, but they're really cool. So whenever I go into the Coliseum to fight somebody, I can pick from the weapons I have because my wallet's connected. And then I battle that person. So this probably here, this is my favorite one ever. Uh, it is the Wellspring Cantana. Now, as you can see, let's pause this here. As you can see, so you have miss, hit, and critical. Uh, so the miss is like the chance percentage-wise you have to miss. Uh, the hit is the amount of damage you could do on a regular hit, and then critical is the overall like big damage you can do. Uh, each weapon is different. Each weapon has their own stats, like I said. So, and then you have your chance at a common uncommon and then um uh, legendary i think it's uncommon or it might be rare oh i get that yeah it's rare it's rare and what i love absolutely love about these weapons they look like cards right they look like cards you want to collect uh it would be awesome if like you get a deck of these cards for your own weapons um but yeah that's just something i absolutely love so if you're ever wondering like oh well what where do i learn more about the coliseum or anything that dragons have going on simple you go into the discord you hit project info here and they got tons of stuff going on in here this tab here is just strictly about the dragon coliseum which is really cool so you can go in here you can learn more about it then you have dragon tools now this is really cool this is something that is 
uh, added on, like you can add it on your browser and use it for JPEG store. I'll show you that in a minute. And then you have the dragon weapons here, dragon gems, um, basically all the stuff, right? Any, any and everything going on with dragons is always found here. Now, one big thing that just came out is the Alpha Surfers Investment Partnership. This partnership is going to be huge. So if you haven't heard of Alpha Surfers, strongly recommend checking them out too. Maybe I'll do a video on them later on. But uh, C. Matt Dye, he is a very smart guy uh, when it comes to investing. So they've partnered up. And the great thing about this is that this helps Ancient Dragon Alliance be a self-sustaining project. Um, basically, they don't need the mint funds. They don't need uh, royalty, stuff like that to stay, to stay afloat. They're, they're doing this investment stuff to stay afloat, right? And in a bear market, that's absolutely insane. For a project to be self-sustaining, that's absolutely bonkers. And it's really, really cool to see. Um, if you want to read more about it, you can go right in here and talk about it. But Alpha Surfers is awesome. And the fact that Angel Dragon Alliance and Alpha Surfers are both partners now, absolutely love it. Now, I did mention that Dragon tool that you can add uh, to JPEG store, right? So when you go in here, you add it in, it, it can tell you right here, like the, the rewards, how much hoard each dragon will earn. And this helps you kind of get a better bang for your buck if you go in there and buy a dragon. So as you can see, there's a couple for the floor price, which is 100 ADA right now, which is awesome to see. The reward, 25 ADA. So that's per day. 25 or not 25 ADA, I'm so sorry. 25 hoard per day. So you can earn 25 hoard per day by just holding that dragon. Now you might be asking, what is the hoard used for? That's awesome. I'm glad you asked. The hoard is used to bid on the raffles that are put up by this project every single month. It's usually towards the end of the clan wars. Now, this is 5,000 ADA every single month, 5,000 ADA worth of um, NFTs that's put up, which is awesome. And then you use that hoard you earn by staking on the mutant platform to bid on these raffles. Now you might win, you might not, but guess what? It's free hoard. So like, as you can see, I have all mine staked. I go here to my rewards and I currently have this much hoard staked right there. And I'm earning 12,230 per day. Love to see it. Love to see it. Um, I've won a few different raffles, but I have horrible luck with raffles. But again, it's free hoard. So I like to go in there and I like to, you know, put some hoard down on the raffles that I really like. So these are some of the recent raffles that were done um, by Ancient Dragon Alliance on, uh, on the mutant platform. And as you can see, there's some pretty awesome stuff in there. There's a lot of awesome stuff in there. You've got House of Titans, Chain, Chains of War, um, you have Crocs on here, Goombles, you got some dragons. I mean, there's all kinds of different things, all kinds of different prices. So it's, it's really cool to see. I, I, you know, it's free hoard for just holding a dragon and you get to use it every month to try to win an NFT for free. And what you do with the NFT is yours. You can sell it and guess what? You just earned a profit. I mean, or you can hold it and see where the project goes. Simple as that. Now there's also on top of weapons, dragons you also have relics now the relics are absolutely stunning i love them and guess what i have my own 3d printed version of a relic here um yeah i had to get the obsidian absolutely love it and it, like this thing is stunning in person i have this one and then i have a smaller one that i have on my desk at work it is so cool to see i absolutely love it absolutely love it um now what's really cool with the relics is you can add gems into the eye sockets so, I mean, it's, it is incredible. Right now, the relic floor is 74 ADA, which is not bad at all. Now, this here is my favorite relic ever. Um, when the relics were first minted, I know I did a video on that, so I'm not really gonna cover all that. But yeah, I absolutely love this one. Listen to that. Oh, listen to that sound effect. Again, Team Obsidian, all the way, 100%. Like, let's go, people, let's go. And if you want to learn more about the relics, again, go right here, project info, and they have all the information right in here for you to learn. And it's, I mean, it is absolutely amazing what all this project has going on. The fact that it is still flying under the radar blows my mind. 
But when people start stumbling across this project, a project that is going to be self-sufficient, you can't beat it because that's a project that's going to be here. Like they're not going anywhere, plain and simple. And if you know Osiris, you know he is one of the hardest working people in the space. I mean, this project is an absolute banger. Uh, not financial advice, do what you want, do your own research, but like, I mean, this is one of those ones you can't beat, you can't miss. Uh, it is absolutely one of my favorite. I hold a lot of dragons for that reason, for my belief in Osiris, uh, but yeah. All right, everybody, that is my update video on Ancient Dragon Alliance. Uh, they have a lot going on. Uh, the Clan Wars is amazing. I need to do a video just on Clan Wars, and I think I might do that here coming up um because it deserves it but all they have going on but yeah that's my video on angel dragon alliance that's my update video i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope each and every single one of you is having a great day thank you for stopping by make every single day the best day possible peace